Good morning and welcome back to our channel. So now we are starting with playlist of cloud formation. So let's start the journey. Let's have overview of the playlist. Before starting this we have some prerequisite. Learner has to have EC2 knowledge. A learner should have basic level of understanding on EC2. Firstly, we will understand what is cloud formation. Then we will learn what is cloud formation stack. We will also learn how to automate task using cloud formation. Then we will learn the anatomy of cloud formation template. And lastly, we will learn how to work with cloud formation designer. So let's start. So now we will discuss about what is cloud formation. This is an introductory video to give an overall idea of what cloud formation is. So let's have an introduction to cloud formation. Before we start, let's discuss something else. Let's take an example that you want to build a house and you want to do it by yourself. So what you need to do for that. So if you want to build the house, then you have to purchase all the materials which you need. You need to build the house. You need to do plumbing and electrical installation works and many more things. But now if you tell someone that you need a house and provide all the specifications and they will do it for you, then you could have a feeling that you are actually automating building your house. Now let's assume that you have some smart human like robots, and you just tell the robots that you need a house, and you give them all the instructions on how the house look like, what would be the design, what kind of resources they should use, what kind of material they should use. So you just specify everything, and you give the instruction message. You have written instructions in a file, in the paper, and you gave it to the robots or you just give instruction by recording an audio or video and they are doing everything. They're building the house based on your instruction, and you feel like you have just started making the task of bringing the house you see just giving instructions. And this is exactly what cloud formation does for us. It's a platform which is just like your robots, in the example that we have just seen. You need to tell cloud formation what you need, and it does those things for you. So instead of doing a lot of things, you can configure a server, or you build a website, or use some resources to provision an application on the clouds. You just tell that hey I want this and this, and this is how I want to deploy that application. Can you do that for me? Cloud formation will surely do the task you want. So if we want to come up with a more formal definition of cloud formation then we can say that it is the service which takes care of provisioning and configuring resource and services, eliminating to those work manually. So the way you give instructions to your team of robots to build the house, is exactly, the same way you work with cloud formation. So you write instructions that you want to perform, and tell cloud formation that, can you do that for me please? And the file where you write all those things is called as template. Each has its own syntax and grammar. So the template has its own syntax grammar. There are specific ways to write template. So once you grab that template and you give it to the cloud formation. In other words in template file you get the instruction a list of the things that you want cloud formation to do for you so that you don't have to do it by yourself. You don't have to spend your time doing all these things. So let's look at an example. You want to create a virtual machine, VM. Where you want to install a web server and then launch a website, by placing the website into the web server, you also want security and user accounts. You have two ways, to achieve this scenario on AWS, first, you can do the whole thing manually. Or second, you can create a file and provide it to cloud formation and it will do all the thing for you automatically. So if you choose to do all this manually then it will be time taking for you. And if you do it with cloud formation, then you have to give instructions in the form of template, where you see the list of things that you want to achieve. And cloud formation, does those things for you, this makes your life easier. So that's it for the video. Meeting you in the next video.